I am going to demonstrate the installation of the Category 1 three-point hitch log skidder attachment and the optional drop-on trailer hitch receiver. To start with, this is a 38 horsepower Kubota with a Category 1 three-point hitch. That's generally between 15 horsepower and 50 horsepower, give or take a few horsepower on the top end, will be a Category 1 three-point hitch. So, to start with, we could adjust the, the maximum inward travel capability of the lift arms to about 28 inches by using your, your turnbuckle type or cable or whatever mechanism your tractor may have to restrict the swing of your lift arms. So, to start with, we bring the mainframe, insert the lift pins into the lift arm bearings, attach the top link pin, and secure it with the lock pin, and install the lock pins on the lift pins. And now we want to verify that the swing arms are at the extreme travel against the locking pin. So I will just uh, snug up my lateral swing a little bit to minimize the swing. We don't want it tight, but that allows for about a half inch space between the lift pin shoulder and the lift arm spherical bearing in there on both sides. Next we bring in the logging tongs. You install those by just putting, attaching the screw pin clevis to the top bushing there. Attach your pull chain to your draw bar by means of some form of secure attachment. In this case I'm using a pin clevis. It can be a pinto hitch pin clevis or some other mechanism that secures this so it can't come loose from your, your draw bar. So now you're ready to skid logs. To use or to install the optional drop-on hitch receiver, we want to remove the logging tongs. Set these aside, either put them in your wagon or throw them in the trailer or you can develop a hook system that you can hang them onto your tractor somewhere. We bring in the drop-on hitch receiver. I rest my left elbow on my left knee and cup the underside of the hitch to take the weight off of it. You insert the top of the drop-on hitch through between your two bushings and rotate the hooks onto your lift pins and let it fall in place. It's installed. It's locked in place. Make sure the locking handle falls down so that it prevents the hitch from falling off. And here you can install any standard two inch hitch receiver with any size of a ball you want. Now you're ready to use your three point hitch for trailers, log splitters, any kind of uh, implement that has a, a ball hitch or a pinto hitch or any other implement you wish to use in your two inch hitch receiver. To remove the drop on hitch, you lift the lift or the lock handle, pick it straight up, rotate the hitch out and away and set it aside. It's all done. Put our log skitter back on. Attach your draw bar pull chain. You're back in business to skid logs.